What's up, everybody? Here is part two of the Bath and Body Works haul. This is going to be a quick paced, um, fast moving video. I'm having a really hard time uploading any videos whatsoever, so I'm going to try to make this as short as possible. Um, let's just jump right in. All right, so first thing I got were some candles. Uh, these were each $2, and this one is the Lilac Blossom. Powerful little thing, set them in a room, walk away, come back in five minutes. I will guarantee you that your room is full of whatever scent you've picked up. So that was Lilac Blossom. So the next one I got is the Watermelon Lemonade. And on first impression, Sweet Pink Lemonade. I don't smell a whole crap load of watermelon, but I'm assuming once I start lighting it, it'll start smelling like watermelon. But it definitely does smell like a sweet, like sweet summertime scent. Should I say that five times fast? So I like that one. The last one that I picked up, I didn't have a lot of time to stand and smell these. Otherwise, <laughs> I probably would have ended up with an entire bag just of those. Was the Georgia peach? And again, you smell there's so many cut up fresh peaches and stuffed them in here. Almost like you know when you open a can of the peaches or like the uh, the fruit cups. You first open it up, it's like peach. Yeah, that's what it smells like. But it smells really, really good. So I'm super. Super excited that I got it. Moving along to shower gels because who doesn't like to be clean? I got peach bellini shower gel and I got a big one because they didn't have any small ones, which I wished I had gotten. First impression, it smells like peaches. Um, but again, like the hand the lotion, it doesn't last. It smells like juicy peach, white apricot, pink grapefruit, fresh mango, and sparkling prosecco. Prosecco. Can't say it, probably butchered it, apologize. But this with the lotion still doesn't last. It still doesn't smell. There's a faint, if best, smell of peaches. Um, but I'll give it another shot with the perfume spray that I now have and see if that doesn't help. Um, the next one I got, and these are all little, little sizes, is the Fresh Brazil Citrus. As you guys know, I have the Fragrance Mist. Love it that with this and the lotion that I have is perfect. This and the Wahoo series are probably two of my favorite summertime sets. So I got that one. Moving along. Oh, I forgot to tell you what's in that one. Sorry. Okay. The next one I got, this came out last year Christmas. My daughter got the spray, loved it, is the Vanilla Wish and Apple Fizz. They're doing construction outside you guys, so I'm really, really sorry if any of it's getting picked up on this video. Um, I had no choice. So this has got, oh, that's the sheet. Hold on. All right. Dazzling Vanilla Apple Fizz Asian Pear Winter Freesia and Sheer Sandalwood. This is probably one of my favorite um, series of fragrances together. It smells so good. You can smell the vanilla. You can smell the um, pear. You can smell the apple all together with a little floral. This is, I hope they could bring this back for Christmas because I will be picking up the entire series because I do like it that much. Um, so I got that one. Super, super excited. Um, the next two things that I got are the trial, they call them trial sizes, but really, you guys, let's be honest, this is at least a couple months worth of product. So I, fine, trial size. I'll try it all till it's gone. It is the Kawhi um, Wave Flower Body Mist, and this was part of the Hawaiian collection. I used this last night at work, and I loved it. I, I wish that I had picked up the um, lotion. They are not having them anymore, so I gotta wait and see if maybe semi-annual sale in January they come out with some more, or if I can pick one up maybe on Amazon, because I do like it. And this one has sugarcane, bamboo, white papaya, frangipani, plumeria, musk fern, coconut milk, island lily, white gardenia, and vanilla orchid. It's a whole hell of a lot in this tiny little bottle. Definitely coconut, definitely floral. It's a light summery scent. It's not heavy on the coconut, but it is there. It's more floral as it dries. It's a really, really good one. If you got it, you know what I'm talking about. If you want to try it, I suggest you try to find it. The next one's a repeat. It's the Sweet Magnolia and Clementine. And you guys know I picked this up um, as part of the semi-annual sale. Loved it. Grabbed this again because I know I'm going to be using it all the time. This was all they had left. Um, I tried to get a lotion 
again. I missed out. My bad. But hey, I will pick that up probably on Amazon as well. But I think that's where you can buy pretty much everything. I'm just dropping stuff over here. All right, next up is the Fresh Brazil Citrus Body Lotion. As you guys know, this is now one of my favorite sets along with the um, Oahu um, Coconut Sunset or Sunset Coconut is my second favorite. Um, I will use, I use those all the time. This has got exotic citrus, luscious pineapple, mango nectar, tiari, tiari, I don't know how to say that. I'm probably butchering it. I'm sorry. Passion flower. And when you first open it up, citrus, pineapple, floral, but it smells good. It's crisp. It's clean. It's summer. It's good. I love it. I'm glad I got it. Moving on. Um, the next three lotions I got are, again, they call them travel sizes. I call them travel sizes. So that's just what I'm going to call them. Um, the first one I got is the Lush Pink Dragon Fruit. I did not get this when it came out, um, when it first came out. Um, but I grabbed this one. This is all they had. Floral. Fruity. Very, it's very, very good. I think I might take this one to work today. I think I might. I don't know. I was thinking about something else today, but I think I might take that one. I like this one. If you got this, you know what I'm talking about. I don't have any information on it. I tried looking online. They didn't have any of the, you know, normal little clips that they usually have for them. Um, but I love this, and I might try and find some Amazon, maybe, again. Um, the next one I got is, it's not a repeat, but I have the um, Travel Size Spray. In it and it's close to cool coconut surf because it's got star fruit in it. Oh, I got it up my nose, but this is good. This is another one that I like. It's very nice summer scent, it goes well with the coconut theme for summer. So I picked that up. And then the last one I got is Hello Sunshine, and I'm really regretting not getting more of this. This has got watery tangerine, fruity apple, green pear, pink peony, red currant, peach blossom, sheer jasmine, white cedar, cotton musk, and tree moss. I don't go shoving tree moss up my nose, but hey, you know. Ugh. Tangerine, apple, peony, maybe a little peach blossom. Holy Jesus, what are they doing out there? Whole house just shook. I don't think I'm insured for a construction damage. This is a very nice summer scent. Um, very crisp, very clean, warm. Love it. So I will try and find some more of that as well. The next two that I got, I apologize for saying nasty things about this. I smelled it in the store initially and just walked off and left it. I went back to the store. They had a whole box of this. I put it on my hand and walked through the store. Let it do its thing, you know. And I kind of liked it. So, I picked it up. This is the Mahogany Teakwood. This is Mahogany Teakwood White Oak Delicate Lavender and Geranium. It is a powerful scent. I will not lie. It is super powerful. It's not one of those light diffusing scents. This is a pow, kick you in the nose scent. Um, I like it. It's a little more masculine, but I like that. It smells kind of like gravity, you know, the cologne for men. But I like it. I picked it up. My husband kind of likes it, so it works for us. The next two kind of go together, um, and I missed out on the fragrance spray. Again, my loss, but it's the Pearberry series. And as I've said before, each part of the collection smells a little different, but this has Andrew Pear, Wild Berries, Apple Blossom, Golden Freesia, and Blonde Woods. And the lotion has way, way more apple scents to it than this does. This has more, I would say, pear. Yeah, this has more pear. This has more apple, but they both smell wicked good. Um, one of my friends at work last night said it smells like Skittles. So I got both of those because one of them I'll use all the time. The other one I'll use mostly at night, mostly in the winter. Um, and it also helps me sleep. I don't know. I don't ask. I don't know. It just does. And the only two giant um, oops, fragrant mists I got were, um, Peach Bellini, 
which I didn't use the day that I used my shower gel and lotion because I totally forgot I had this. I just there's just nothing for sin. I'm just I'm really disappointed in this series. I think I really wish that I could return these, but I don't have my receipts and I don't do that once I buy something I buy and I don't take it back. So I'm regretting buying those, but again I will give it um, another fair shot at trying to be what I want it to be and then I'll let you guys know. Um, but the last one that I got, this is all they had. I really, really, really wish I'd gotten the, the lotion because I really do like this scent, was the white tea and ginger. It smells so good. It kind of reminds me almost of the Dove um, deodorant, the cool, cool cucumber and green tea. This smells really good. I really, really like this. This is going to be good for summer and fall. I don't know about winter, but we'll see. So that's all that I got. This is the second series of the haul. I'm sorry that I didn't spend a whole lot more time on these, but like I said, I'm having trouble uploading. So if you like them, thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. would love to hear from you guys. If you haven't subscribed and you want to, I would love to have you as part of my family. If you already have subscribed, thank you for sticking with me. And until next time, you guys.